a knob made of clay. A sinister-looking heavyweight contender with a deadly jab from a CO2 gas pressurized ram capable of lifting one and a half tons. Inventor Rex Garrods built Teletubby toys at 79.3 kilograms. Oh, this is a lean and mean machine. Roboteers, stand by. Cassius, one of the competition favorites. Rex Garrod's been here before. Recyclops by the pyramid is in problems here. She will not be pleased. Do you think it can do better this time? I hope so. Uh, it's, a, it's a pretty nimble robot this time, and it has this nasty weapon. So talk me through it. Tell me what this robot's got. Um, the whole thing is um, a little bit high tech, but that's the weapon that will lift about a ton and a half. So this gets underneath something and then brings it up. It should get somebody um, almost out of the arena. So could that lift the killer lot, for example? Uh, well, if he is under a ton and a half, yes. <laughs> Three, two, one, activate. So this wedge-shaped robot then, to the start of the gauntlet. It's going to take on the Sentinel down this path. Got a little bit of luck and a bit of speed and through, and Dead Metal can't stop it. That's a great run by Cassius. Too late for Dead Metal to come in now. Well done, Rex. Um, well, you were a finalist in the last war, weren't you? Yes. Uh, you controversially beat Mortis in the last war, didn't you? Yes, uh, that was a good fight. We're having a grudge match again, I hope, which will be good. Are you confident about this war? Quietly confident, but, um, you know, lots of things are going to happen. I mean, it's a matter of luck whether you get past some of these things, really. But I have an advantage. It's very nimble and it's also... Um, very fast. quick. Yes. Ladies and gentlemen, Rex Garrard, cash it! Cassius floats like a butterfly, stings like a bee, power and pace is Rex Garrard's key. Cassius through, completing the course. Well done. Three, two, one, activate. A goalkeeper with a flamethrower and a fullback with tusks. You wouldn't want to fall back on Matilda, would you, at any stage? This is good work in there immediately, though, by Loco! Loco scores! Set through! They'll be removed from the arena for the next round. Gives you some size of the scale of things here and the weight of Loco. Three, two, one. Activate. Wizard nearest the ball. In comes Cassius. Wizard almost toppled by Matilda. Cassius in possession. Rex Garros put that scoop on the front look. Control the ball. Rex, the goal's this way. Rex, the goal is this way. This way. This way, Rex. Floats like a butterfly, stings like a bee. Matilda in there. Slow progress by Rex Garab. He's using the touchline board. Matilda in there. Surely that's a foul tackle, referee. Matilda doesn't know the meaning of the word foul. Chasing Cassius away. Groundhog there in the middle of your picture. Steady work by Cassius and in the end rewarded, yes! Rex Garrod through! Three left. Cassius against Wizard. If there were other people around who were much younger than you and had put a lot of time in to a robot and you were up against them, what would be your options? Well, I couldn't possibly destroy their robot. For all the rice in China, I couldn't do that. That's against the principles completely. I want to encourage kids to build them. I don't want to destroy them. So if I could immobilise them without doing them any harm, yes. But I certainly wouldn't be able to destroy them. No way. Now, a house robot, that's different. Three, two, one. Activate. The bizarre bot morality of Rex Garrard. There's Wizard. An early surge up to 50 miles an hour. But in comes Cassius. Cassius faster, lighter, but strong enough to upend dead metal. This is a good surge of power. 25 miles an hour, Rex can get on Cassius. Taking on the house robots, that's what he said he'd do. Now he takes on Wizard, pushing it into the perimeter patrol zone. This is where our house robots are king. There's Killalot and Bash behind. In comes the Ram, trying to flick Killalot off. In comes Cassius again to take on Wizard, Bash in there as well. Wizard's in trouble here, immobilised. Pushed in with the house robots, can't get out. That's the end of Wizard for me. Killalot and Bash in there as well. Richard Johnson will try and steer it away, but Rex Garrard with Cassius showing more style, more aggression, and again taking on the house robots, taking on Bash, taking on the circular saw. The big 
CO2 gas powered ram can't flick bash away. Kill a lot closing in and Cassius loves it. This is what Rex said he'd do and he's doing it. Spinning away. He's taking them away. Taking them away from Wizard. Wizard, take the platform. Cassius, take the platform. Well, guys. You didn't really stand a chance, did nah, you? Nah, we were dead before we even started, I think. Yeah, Cassius were sort of clear winners there, weren't oh, they? Oh, yeah, definitely. Never mind. Look after yourselves, Cassius. <laughs> you took on everyone. Shunt, dead metal. You even have a good go at kill a lot. Well, yeah, got to try, haven't you? That's what it's all about, isn't it? Well, we're here to fight. You're here to fight, and so you did certainly get stuck in. One more fight, if you do the Surrey semi finals, you're feeling confident? Well, the weak link is me. <laughs> Why are you the weak link? I can't steer the dead thing. <laughs> you, you seem to drive excellently today. No. Ladies and gentlemen, Cassius. Well done, lads. The final. Loco against Cassius. I've come for a secret liaison with him because earlier I asked you how do you feel if you ever got pitted against the boys on the loco team and They're now you've kids. ended up in the final. Well, yeah, I know, but uh, you know, these children have learned a heck of a lot about engineering and that's great. Why destroy it? That's pointless. I make things like this for a living and then poor little devils, it's the first thing they've done and it took them months to I'm not going to destroy it in any way. We've almost got a pacifist on Robot yeah. Wars. <laughs> Three, two, one, activate. Will Rex practice what he preaches in the final? Dodging, spinning, dancing with Loco, avoiding that spring-powered ram, getting in underneath Loco, bashing and crunching, almost going into the PPZ. Oh, David Isles and Richard Manning, the 13-year-olds, doing well here in the final. There's that spring-loaded ram shooting out in front of Loco, flipped up and over. Immobilised, but no damage caused. Rex Garrod as good as his word. There was that flick up of the big CO2 gas ram from Cassius. Now the house robots come in. Oh, don't cause them damage. Young Richard Mannion and David are trying to get Loco away. Cassius, don't you touch my mate. Get away, dead metal. Cassius here like a Robin Hood character. Shunt, mean and merciless, Matilda too. No place for pacifists in Robot Wars, say the house robots. Tusk, tusk, says Matilda on Cassius. In comes Dead Metal. Meanwhile, we know that Loco flipped up out of it. This is just a question of what punishment can be meted out onto Cassius and Rex Garrard. Oh, look at the sparks flying here. What's happened with the sparks flying? Cassius with Dead Metal and Matilda and Shunt all in here, creating damage. Will Cassius, surely the winner of this heat, be fit enough for later on in the competition? The question has to be asked. Yes, on the evidence of that. They love him. A little pirouette of delight. Oh, magnificent. And he's flipped Matilda. It's the second time he's done it. He's the star of the show. Look at that. Threw them in. Up goes Matilda. He's taken on them all. And finally, I think this could be some respite for Rex if they nudge him in. Oh, it's a tired Cassius, but it's a victorious Cassius. Great final. That's what Robot Wars is all about. That's good fun, wasn't it? You, you took on them all. Well, yeah, you got to try. You, you must try. You ended up in the pit. But look, look at Matilda. Looks dead. You bashed her. You yeah, bashed them dead. all. Yeah. It's such a fast robot, yours, isn't it? Yeah. Always on your control, then. <laughs> <laughs> Loco didn't get a look in. No. Well, I, I weren't really interested in Loco. I, I like a house robot. That's better fun. Well, look, we'll see you in the series yeah. semi-final. Another round of applause, ladies and gentlemen. Godzilla devoured 40 floors, but we chopped them down to size. On Robot Wars. Good night. Wow, what a battle to be involved in. Yeah. yeah. Well, we knew he was going to do it. Was there an element of protectiveness, though? 